Tonight, a family demanding that the Fulton County Jail be held accountable for an inmate's death. An attorney for Samuel Lawrence's family says a new report shows he died from asphyxia due to strangulation after he repeatedly expressed concerns for his safety inside the jail. Latasha Givens is live at the jail with more. Latasha, what do we know today? Well, Faith, the family attorney says Samuel Lawrence was so concerned about his safety. He filed this 16 page handwritten civil rights report, and the attorney says even though this report outlines a number of vicious attacks he suffered while in jail, deputies still failed to protect him. He died a gruesome, horrific, violent death, and the family of Samuel Lawrence wants justice. Kenneth Muhammad is the attorney for Samuel Lawrence's family. He says this is a copy of the medical examiner's report on Lawrence's death after he was found unresponsive in his cell back in August. The uh, autopsy report indicates that there was blunt force trauma to the head, that he was strangled, that there was uh, uh, injury to his torso area and multiple injuries. The document states the cause of death is asphyxia due to strangulation and the manner of death is listed as a homicide. 11 Alive reached out to the medical examiner's office but have not independently verified this report. The county is responsible for the death uh, of Samuel Lawrence. The Fulton County Sheriff's Office failed in its obligation to protect him. Muhammad says the prisoner's civil rights complaint Samuel Lawrence wrote alleges other inmates attacked him multiple times and he repeatedly expressed concerns about his safety. And as he cried out, there was no help. And that hurt me bad. Lawrence's father says the pain of losing a son never goes away. And I'm gonna miss my son because I got to think about him every, every day of my life. And I don't know when the pain stops, it never stops. We reached out to the Fulton County Sheriff's Office for their response to these allegations and the civil rights report. We'll let you know when we hear back. All right, Latasha, thank you so much.